Hi, this is uh, Pat, and uh, welcome to Patriot Ford. We are located 10 minutes south of Norman along I-35. Right there is the interstate, if you can see it in the background. And today we're going to talk about this, uh, the all-new 2015 F-150 Super Crew King Ranch four-wheel drive. This baby has literally got every single option on it that you can get uh, short of a bed liner. So I'm going to try to make this pretty quick. Um, it is an FX4 off-road truck with a max trailer tow package. Of course on these new pickups, one of the neat things about them is they got this tailgate that will let itself down. The new tailgate step is now integrated into the tailgate. There you go. That's an extended tailgate step. Unlike before, when the tailgate step was on, lay, it laid on top of the tailgate. And the problem with that was, if you tried to slide anything off the bed or put anything on it, the tailgate step always got in the way, especially the handle. So now that's not a problem anymore. You got your class three receiver hitch there. You'll notice on these new F-150s everywhere, kind of like the old ones had some of these sensors in the back for the rear bumpers on beeping. This will have them all over the place. Has them on the side right here. And that's because they're also on the front. And they're a little harder to see because they're kind of in between. But basically what's going on is this vehicle's got adaptive cruise control and a collision warning system so it can see up front. It can uh, change the and detect uh, speed changes on uh, other vehicles in front of you or in, on your side when you're making lane changes. It also has a lane keeping system so if you uh, have a tendency to drift a little bit it'll correct and put you back in the right spot. Of course this King Ranch is equipped with a 3.5 liter EcoBoost engine that's a twin turbo producing 420 foot pounds of torque and it is quite impressive. This engine's been around for a while and uh, they are tried and true. So. Uh, it uh, takes a little bit of getting used to because it's not quite your normal V8 sound like most of them are, but uh, it's unbelievable power. So this King Ranch is equipped with the King Ranch uh, chrome appearance package. So it's got the mirror caps, the door handles, the 20 inch LVD chrome wheels, chrome grill insert. Those are all part of the chrome appearance package. Now this one is a chrome appearance package with a monotone. So this is not a tan bottom or a caribou bottom truck. And you can see there's your rear backup camera right here. You'll, we're going to check into the camera system here in just a minute. But notice that's the first camera. There's actually a total of uh, four cameras on this vehicle. The other two is one on either side. One's right here. And then the other one's down here on the bottom of this oval. And these are fisheye lens, 180 degree cameras. They, all, um, they are part of the 360 camera system, which is included in the technology package. You'll notice on King Ranch it is now, they are equipped with power running boards. That is something that previously did not exist, as King Ranchers have always had fixed running boards. Now this vehicle is equipped with the memory seat package, and like, uh, not unlike vehicle the trucks before, they obviously will uh, center your mirror positions, center your seat positions back to where you had them programmed. But this will also center the power t tilt and telescoping steering wheel. So this comes in and out, and you set it all where you want it as part of your memory package, <coughs> and voila, it does that. Something else that I uh, is a uh, new to the F-150 family is the touch. These doors are so light with this aluminum. So that locks the doors. Not unlike the two buttons on the keypad, but now it's also unlocked. As long as the key is within the proximity of the vehicle, in other words on me, and it really can detect it. And we'll talk about the back seat here for just a second. So. One of the new things on the 15 model F-150 is the option of the 400 watt inverter, which there's an outlet on the dash up there to the right of the, the climate control system, and then 
previously they were 150 watt inverters and are now 400 if you get the upgraded uh, 400 watt inverter. Underneath the back seat here now is the bracket system that comes in that box right there for the the bed rails which are all new to this bed so you got a set of um, options right here that allow you to configure a bunch of accessories for these beds. There's a total of four of these hooks and the, that little box inside has the cleats in them. There's a little button down here that inside the bed that turns on the bed lights. You got one there, one there, and the two up there. And they go on and off with um, the switch. And the uh, 400 watt inverter system is now hosted down here below the seat on the right rear where previously the Sony subwoofer was. And the Sony subwoofer is now, you can just barely see it there, located behind the center of the rear seat. The first thing you'll notice is the all new dash layout. Equipped with push button start. Let's get a good feel for the inside right here. Now, one thing that's new about the King Ranch interior is these are actually finished in a real wood. This is a real wood finish, not plastic. And you can actually feel the imperfections in the wood. It's quite impressive. Okay, so equipped with navigation, standard options like uh, we've seen on a lot of these My Ford Touches. Uh, now you got a heated steering wheel option, which will start getting this warm in just about 30 seconds or so. Well, you can actually already feel it. Heated and cooled seats, but now the buttons are lined up a little bit different down here, where you can do them as well down here. The four-wheel drive with a four automatic option. Locking rear differential. Engage four high on the, you just barely see it on the left there. Back to two wheel drive, turn that locking differential off. Up top we have the all new twin panel moon roof. And that sunshade will actually go all the way back. So it's a twin panel, and the first panel actually just moves completely open. Wind break. All part of the new twin panel moonroof. Which the twin panel moonroof is only available in the crew cab, otherwise, you can only get a single panel moonroof. Okay, so this vehicle is also equipped with adaptive cruise control. So that's what this feature, right? these buttons right here control. They control the gap distance between you and a vehicle in front of you. So if you turn the cruise control on, you'll notice down here in the center there is a cruise control setting, which if I was to set the speed, it would give me an actual miles per hour speed setting. Let's see if we can put this in the shade a little bit. And now you can actually see that setting in the middle there where can I can adjust this gap. So you can change how far you want the vehicle to stay back from the next vehicle or how close you want it to be. So that has a big impact on how fast the traffic's moving and all those kinds of things. Uh, to go with that, you have um, a lane keeping system. That's this button right here. That would allow you to override it, turn it on or off, disengage, engage, and the same thing with the active park uh, control system, That's which is this button here. Basically, press the button, and the vehicle will begin scanning on the right-hand side for a blank spot. If you were parallel parking, once it finds the gap, it'll ask you to stop, and then from there on, it gives you instructions to release your hands from the wheel and back itself into a spot. Very impressive. So... Um, of course, a uh, single CD is in the dash here, and then of course a navigation system on the top right 
and all the Bluetooth features and audio streaming capabilities that you can think of. Since this vehicle is equipped with the Max Trailer Tow Package, and here we'll also find um, the trailer brake controller, the integrated controller. Of course, this is upgraded to 355 gears and uh, upgraded rear bumper and upgraded uh, radiators. Over here on the left side, you'll see we have two little buttons there that look like they belong to the uh, outside rear view mirrors and what those really affect is the LED lighting system that is meant to supplement the head headlight system and it's basically like additional set of flashlights that come on on the outside of the vehicle. Of course this vehicle is equipped 100% with LED headlights and the LED tail lights which you probably saw when we were walking around the outside of the vehicle. One of the things that we needed to talk about here on this uh, King Ranch F-150 that we have been looking at is the 360 degree rear view camera system or outside camera system. Um, when you put the vehicle in reverse now, um, by default the camera system will kick on and show you the rear view of the vehicle. But then in addition to that we have a um, fish eye view of the outside vehicle in 360 degree range. So what we're looking at here is this is the rear of the vehicle. These are the two side cameras that it shows you. And then across the top it shows you the uh, front 180 degree camera. Um, of course these camera settings can be invoked just by pressing the button up here without having to be in reverse and you can actually see all the outside the outside portion of the camera or the vehicle even when you're pulling forward. So there's one where you can get it and it's going to show us this is the front of the vehicle now the reason this would be important is if I'm pulling out of a parking spot and there are vehicles on either side or coming out of an alley and I could not, the visibility was poor, this would allow me to see, as you can see from here, left or right in 180 degree direction. So as I begin to pull out, I have a clear view of what's about to clip the front of the vehicle. And in doing so, I get a much better uh, decision making ability in, in uh, moving the vehicle in and out of tight areas or out of tight alleyways or on streets where the visibility coming out is just not that good. So um, again that's the 360 degree camera system that's on the brand new F-150. Um, for details again talk to us here at Patriot Ford 10 minutes south of Purcell or Norman in Purcell. Um, there are a lot more options and uh, systems in this vehicle in the way of uh, information providing and uh, traffic information and those kinds of things. So uh, give us a call here at Patriot Ford and we'll be glad to share more details about it.